I said, empty your mind. Be formless, shapeless, like water. Now you put water into a cup, it becomes the cup. You put water into a bottle, it becomes the bottle. You put it in a teapot, it becomes the teapot. Now water can flow or it can crash. Be water, my friend. might sound too philosophical, but it's unacting, acting, or acting, unacting, if you need. Yeah, I mean, it's a combination of both. I mean, here is the natural instinct, and here is control. You are to combine the two in harmony. Not, if you have one to the extreme, you will be very unscientific. If you have another to the extreme, you become all of a sudden a mechanical man no longer a human being, so you, it is a successful combination of both. Therefore, it is not only, I mean, so therefore it's not pure naturalness or unnaturalness. The ideal is unnatural naturalness or natural unnaturalness. <laughs> yin yang. To me, ultimately, martial art means honestly expressing yourself. Oftentimes people come up and say, hey Bruce, are you really that good? I said, well, if I tell you I'm good, probably you will say I'm boasting. But if I tell you I'm no good, you know I'm lying. <laughs> but, alright, going back to be truthful with you. Let's just put it this way. I've told people all over the world that Bruce Lee was one of my idols. Bruce Lee is my idol. <laughs> so Bruce Lee is your idol? Yeah, I do. Okay. Yeah. I remember, you know, I was always a big fan of Bruce Lee. I believe in that style. I believe in that martial arts. Because it was more, it was more mental than just physical. I'm going to learn some techniques of Bruce Lee, the quickness of his hands.